guys, today it is Mary Ellen and Kat here. And today we are going to be doing a fun finds video inspired by Dina and Bina because she does them weekly on her channel. And basically today I'm just going to be showing you guys some fun things I got at Dollar Tree and Michaels that are definitely affordable and won't break the bank, but are also very adorable for your 18 inch American girl dolls. So I got one, two, three, four, five things to show you guys. So these are basically just going to be five affordable, awesome things you can use for your dolls. And as I said before, they won't break the bank and they're still just as cute. So let's just hop right into the video and get started. Okay, so first is this lamp from Dollar Tree and it comes in black, red, and blue. And basically it's just one of those little lights that like Pixar uses, it's just that little like foldable light. And basically it just says LED mini desk lamp style book light. And basically this one's already opened, but I'm just going to open it. And basically what comes inside is two pieces. It's really easy to assemble. It's just this base, which has a little hole in it. And then it's just the body of the light. So you just put the light in the hole and you are good to go. You have your little doll lamp. And isn't this just so cute? It could go easily in any room. And this is the best part. It turns on. So this is just super cute. Oops, I don't have it pressed in. Okay, now I do. So this is a super cute feature for any doll room. And as I said before, it comes in many different adorable colors. And it's just a very cute, Oh, that fell off. Well, if you wanted to see what the inside looks like, here you go, because the back just fell off. But basically, it's just a very cute lamp that is basically just a cute, it's just a cute feature for any doll room. And it's perfect on any doll night table. I'm just going to quickly show you how articulated these are. So basically, on these lights, you can move right here, right here, and you can even turn them a bit down here. So they're very movable lights and you can pretty much set them just the way you want. Okay, so this is just a quick little look at them. As you see, they come in like a royal blue color, a red color, and a black color. And I think these are super cute for any doll room and I would rate these probably like a nine out of 10 just because since they are dollar store, sometimes they fall and are hard to pick back up. But other than that, they're very cute. So the next thing that I got from the dollar store was another lamp and this one also retails for a dollar because I dollar got it at Dollar Tree so everything's a dollar and basically it just has a white base with a color of your choice um, little shade and I know these come in more than the two colors that I got but the only colors they had there was purple and a fluorescent yellow so I will show you them both in a second and basically on the bottom it just describes what it is it says absorbs light from the sun or indoor lighting illuminates in the darkness no electricity required so i thought i even though this one doesn't really work i just thought this one was cute to put on a doll nightstand as well and this one's just like very soft and it's just plastic and it's still super cute and for a dollar you cannot go wrong so these are both of the lamps that glow in the dark i haven't tried it yet so i do not know whether they work or not but they're pretty basic just white base little tag on the bottom and then they're just the soft matte color so i only got two of these because there was only two color options so i just got this yellow color and this purple color and i think these are super cute and I'm going to go test them out, so let's go. Hey guys, so I'm currently in a closet, so sorry for the bad lighting and the greeny texture, but I just wanted to show you what they look like in the dark. So this bluish color one right here is the purple one, and this like bright green color is the yellow one, so it's pretty much just what they look like. They're very cute. I really love the purple one in the dark. The yellow one's a little too bright for me, but they still look really cute. Okay, so now I am moving on to the last final Dollar Tree item. And these are going to be super cute and I love the colors. So my mom actually found these for me and they're basically just 40 mini clothespins and look at those colors. 
They are so pretty. One of them is bright white. The next is a lilac purple color. The next is royal blue. And the last one, I don't really know what to call it, like call that color. It's like a lightish green, but these are super cute. And I'm going to open them up and show you guys what they look like. Okay, so I just opened these and guys, can we take a moment to appreciate how cute these are? They are so cute and I think they actually, yeah, they open, with some force they open and these are so cute. So I'm gonna put it next to the doll's hand and let's see really how good these are. So I just zoomed in. That is a really good size actually. These are gonna be so cute for back to school stuff with the dolls and room decor. And these are awesome. I totally recommend these for anybody who wants to consider these because I mean, for a dollar and then you get 40 of these, that's really a good deal. So as you can tell, just a little bit more detailed view. They're so cute. I totally recommend these for like, if you guys know how it's, uh, people consider it tumbler to hang up the little pieces of string with these little clips and little Polaroid pictures. So maybe you could use these for those. These for those. Maybe you could use these for that craft. I'm not really sure. I just picked them up because I thought they were adorable, doll sized, and you can pretty much use those clips anytime you want. So they're definitely a great deal for 40 for a dollar. Okay, so the next thing is from Michaels, and this was $2, and it's this little frame. It is not in focus at all. It's this frame that is four inches by six inches, and it has this little twisty thing because then there's this thing in the back that it stands on, and I've seen a couple of people who have this, and basically I'm going to be making it into a doll TV for my dollhouse that I just built, but I will do a dollhouse tour super soon. Just, it's really not complete yet in my mind. It's uh, it's still really getting there. So I'm not going to do a dollhouse tour quite yet because I don't even have it finished yet. So basically it's just this frame and I'm going to open it up, put it together and show you guys how good of a size comparison it is. and if you guys haven't already noticed all those dinging sounds in the background I'm really sorry I was put in a group chat on AG Instagram and my phone is blowing up ever since so shout out to you if you know who you are hashtag I think it's the secret Santa school that's texting me anyways so the first thing and the large item is this black frame and it's pretty much just the base for the TV and then there's this thing, which obviously, as I already told you guys, screws onto the little peg that's sticking out from the TV. And also, this plastic came inside of it. And you can't really see, you can see the glare, so that's how you know it's there. I rhymed, yay. Okay, anyway, so basically, this can go over the TV screen to look to make the picture look more realistic. So I thought that was awesome that it was included because now I'm going to use it over the picture that I decide to print out for my TV. So basically I'm really lazy and I haven't printed out a picture yet. So I'm just going to slide the plastic in here and put this together to show you guys what it looks like. Okay, I got it. So as you can tell, this is awesome for a flat screen TV. It's a little large, but hey, no one ever said it couldn't be a large TV, right? So size comparison to the doll. Well, this is kind of hard to do one handed, so I'm gonna zoom out. So this is Mary Ellen, standing right here in front of me. As you all know, she's 18 inches. And this is how big the TV is. So it's a pretty good size. It definitely could qualify as like a bigger TV, but I think it's awesome. And I'm going to go put it in the dollhouse and show you guys right, oh, sorry, my own. And I'm going to show you guys right now. Okay, so basically it is on top of my doll's fireplace right now. And I think it looks super cute. I think it is just the right size for a doll flat screen. And I will definitely be putting a picture into it and inserting a picture right about now of what it looks like. 
as the final product. And sorry that's really shaky, I'm not on my tripod right now. So yeah, sorry about that. So the last thing that I got at McDo McDonald's, McDonald's, cat, get your act together. Okay, so the last thing I got from Michaels was these adorable picture frames and I could not pass the offer up because they were $1.50 in my clearance section at Michaels. So this one is just a little over two inches by 2.83 inches. This one is also the same measurement. It is aqua blue and it is 2.4 inches by 2.83 inches. And this one's different. This one is hot pink and it's a rectangle and it's out of focus now all of a sudden. Wow, thanks camera. This one is 2.28 by 2.28. So this one's just like a rectangle. The other two are pretty much well, these two are like upright rectangles. That one is a long rectangle. Anyways, I'm going to be opening up both one of each size. So I'm gonna be opening the white one and the hot pink one to show you guys pretty much an in-depth tour and if they're worth the $1.50 that I spent on them. So pretty much when you open it up, it's just like a regular picture frame. It has the real back and everything, and then it has this, so you can prop it up on like a coffee table or side table if you want to. It even has the little peg right here that you screw to the side to open it. And I think these are so cute. For a dollar and fifty cents, these are just like a real picture frame, just in mini doll size. And as you can see, a size comparison. They're pretty good size, actually. They're pretty good size for a picture frame so I will definitely be printing out some of my pictures from my AG Instagram and putting them in these frames and a little bit of self promo right now my Instagram is redwatermelons.ag you guys should really check it out I work really hard on my pictures so if you guys could give a follow and maybe give some feedback that'd be awesome um, so basically I'm just gonna quickly open the pink one now and yeah So basically I have them out. These frames are um, really heavy. I think it's because they're kind of just like a little heavy. I think it is because of the material that's on the sides. But this one's pretty much the exact same. It has the little fold out thing, little thing that you move so that you can open it. So I think they're pretty similar. And again with this one I will be printing out a photo for my AG Instagram and pretty much just putting it in. So. That is all for today. That is all the five things that I got from either Dollar Tree or Michaels. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. This video is pretty different from my other videos. I've never really done a video like this before. So comment down below if you want me to do more videos like this because I think, yeah, I really like making this video because I really like sharing with you guys fun finds that I get for a good price so that you can get them too for your dollhouse because I'm with you on not wanting to spend like $20 per doll lamp, so that's why I got these ones at the dollar store. So basically, yeah, that's pretty much it. So please remember to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will be back at you guys with another video on either Saturday or Wednesday, whatever day this video is posted. I have so many videos clogged up that I have not posted yet, so this video will probably be posted like two weeks after I actually recorded it. Uh, but yeah, just again, be sure to check these things out at your local do dollar store or Michaels. So I'm just going to go over them really quickly again. So these are the lamps for $1 that glow in the dark from the Dollar Tree. These are the ones that turn on again from Dollar Tree. These are the one, these are the picture frames from Michaels for $1.50. And the TV is currently in the doll living room, but that is $2 for the frame. But I had a coupon today, so I think I only spent $1.50 on it. So, again, all under $2, all great items. And I totally recommend you check out your local Michaels and Dollar Tree and try to find some of the items I found. Oh, wait, I forgot the clothespins. Well, clothespins, $40 for a dollar at Dollar Tree. Never can go wrong with clothespins. So yeah, that is it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Comment down below again if you want me to do more videos like this. I really like helping you guys out in dollhouse decor and such. I'm going to be doing a collab with 
AG Lollipop soon. I might do it. I might have already done it by the time this video is up. But yeah, it's going to be room decor. So look out for that video. So basically, I have a lot of fun videos coming. Spring room decor. I might do more of these videos to help you guys out. And also a dollhouse tour. So be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And especially subscribe so you know when I get all those new videos up. Because I'm pretty confident in them and I think they're going to rock. So I'm rambling now and my camera's about to die. As pretty much every other video I make, I say the same exact thing in every outro. Oops. But anyways, that is it and I will see you guys next time. Bye!